The final round of the Saudi Open presented by PIF produced some excellent low scoring and as convincing a victory as you will ever see. Denwit Boribunsab, the 20-year-old defending champion, finished impressively with a 63. Didn't quite make his eagle at the last, but got into the top 20 at seven under par. David Puge birdied the fifth, but wasn't quite able to get as close as he needed to the overnight leader. A 67, though, for Puge, and he finishes in the top five. It's good to see Kiradek Apibarnrat back to something like his best form. He, too, shot a 67, finished 15 under par, and for the second day in a row, eagled the 12th. This was his approach to that par five. Another man who made eagle at 12, but perhaps rather more dramatically, was the American Peter Ulight. A six birdie, 63, plus this eagle at 12, and he finishes tied for third. The runner-up, Wade Ormsby. A birdie putt at the sixth for the Australian, one of eight on his card, a 64 for 17 under. But there was no catching the man who led at the start of the day by all of eight shots, John Catlin of the USA. He hardly made a mistake all week. This was the tee shot at the par 3 8th as he began to stretch ahead of his challengers. There was another birdie to come at the 13th. He putted beautifully all week, hardly missed anything. It took him until the 14th to make his first bogey of the week, the only bogey on his card. He birdied 17. This on the way to a closing 66. And of course, he birdied the final hole just to win it in style. What a performance. 24 under par. He wins by seven. A wire to wire victory. And two in a row for John Catlin of the US here at the Saudi Open.